Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Rie Marie, Sherry Marie, Sherry Ann Marie, whatever you want to call me. Don't mind my hair, but if you want to see how I got this look, continue watching. Welcome back to my channel. If you're not new, if you're new, subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell button. I'm about to go do my eyebrows off camera. I'm going to be opening, well, unboxing this box from Ulta Beauty that I purchased. I'm going to be trying out the Morphe, the 3052 palette, my first Morphe palette. I'm going to show you guys the colors. Working with. All right, the next thing I got is this Revolution um, Makeup Revolution Flawless Pore Palette. It has 32 professional eyeshadows, and this is the palette. It's so cute. Can you guys see? Yeah, and this is the palette. Okay. This is the palette. I was debating if I wanted to use the Morphe or this palette, but I think I'm going to go with the Morphe palette today. I also picked up a e.l.f. makeup and mist spray. Um, some Ardell lashes and um, they have a sale because it's spring, so yeah, I got these. Um, and when you order stuff online from them they give you like a either a skincare thing or a makeup product or something else so they gave me um the becca cosmetics um liquid highlighter um this is the press highlighter and this is the um shimmering skin protector pore cream highlighter and they also gave me some hair food, the shampoo and the conditioner by Clairol. I don't know if I'm gonna try that though. Because I got black people here. Anywho, I wish this Morphe palette had a mirror in it. Oh yeah, also I did pick up a, where is it? Oh, they have it in another. It's the NYX NYX eyeshadow base in white. So. I'm just gonna do my eyeshadow now. I'm gonna start off with the NYX base. So I'm gonna prep my eyelids with this. Oh wait, it has something on top of it. Can you guys see? I was trying to use natural lighting. What's up, baby? My son looking at me, watching me like, what is you doing? All right, so right here, I'm just setting the NYX base with a shadow that's similar to the same color. Now I'm going in with the shade right here all over my eye. Next, I'm going in with a shade similar to the one I just used before, but I'm focusing it more into my crease. Now I'm using a darker shade similar to the same two colors before and just putting that on the outer parts of my crease. And now for the smoky fiery red. <laughs> now I'm putting this all over my crease outer parts of my crease all over except for my lips you can just continue adding as much red as you want to intensify the look and then I'm going to be blending this out just to take the harsh lines away Then I added the shimmery orange in the palette to my lid. So I used the Milk Blur Stick in my T-zone and I see a difference for real. And then I went in with my favorite Smashbox Photo Finish Primer and I put that all over my face. So I'm just going to go ahead and beat my warm honey everywhere. 
and I'm going in with the Maybelline, my favorite. Really, Monaco. Maybelline 24 Super Stay. I'm going everywhere with that. I got Kodak's black hairstyle and with NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer and Caramel. Just for added highlight. Not too much dough. Now I'm just setting my highlight with my Laura Mercier translucent powder in medium deep. I'm using the Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Kit just to chisel out my cheeks a bit and contour my face. So to finish off the look, I'm just going to add the reddish color under my lash line, add some mascara to my bottom line, um, bottom <laughs> lash line. Um, also, spray my face with this e.l.f. mist and makeup set spray, and I'm going to add some highlight. So for um, highlight, I used a bronzer, NYX bronzer, and for lips. I just line my lips with um, NK lip liner, a reddish shade, I couldn't find my brown one, and I use the Fenty Beauty um, Fenty Glow Gloss Wand. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Um, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share, like, you know, if you recreate this look, tag me. Make sure you follow me on all my social media, and don't forget to comment and subscribe. Love you guys.